Well, it doesn't look like very much right now. I don't know if you guys can hear. It's basically like freezing rain sleet that's hitting our windows. It's just like pinging constantly. All that looks like snow, and I think it is a little bit, but honestly, it's mostly ice. So winter storm Landon, I think is what they're calling it, is here. Um, we actually are on a level two snow emergency, which here in Ohio, that means like basically don't be on the roads unless it's absolutely necessary. Um, and then the next step would be a level three, which is basically like no one's allowed on the roads except for like emergency vehicles. So um, it's not so much the snow. Obviously you saw we didn't have that much. It's really just the ice. I guess we're just, it's been freezing rain since like two or 3 a.m. last night and it's 11 now. So it's just constant freezing rain making a lot of ice. So yeah, not cool. And Grayson got his first ever snow day today because we're on a level two, you can't go out on the road. So they closed yesterday. Hi, Grayson. Are you enjoying your snow day? Yeah. Are you sad you didn't go to preschool today? Yeah. Yeah? I'm sad about it. I like it when he goes to preschool. Today was supposed to be red day. He's supposed to wear something red, so I guess I'll push it back to Tuesday now. So it just makes a long weekend even longer <laughs> because he only went to school one day this week and we're just gonna get snowed in. They're predicting, last I saw it said four to seven inches of snow and we haven't really even got the snow yet. I guess it's not supposed to snow, start really snowing until like two or three. We are getting hit with the storm. All the Columbus schools are canceled. Um, even like down in Cincinnati, they're all canceled because they're supposed to get a good amount of snow and ice too. So yeah, it's just a bummer. We're stuck in the house, probably be stuck in the house like all weekend. We don't have any plans, which is nice. Um, I even heard like out of our airport, like all the flights are canceled. So really crazy. We are just hanging out. Gray, what does your shirt say? Big bro. Big bro, are you a big bro? Who's your little bro? Porter. Porter? Say hi, Porter. Uh, yeah, kinda. You're both wearing blue shirts. Porter's eating his lunch. Well, he's kind of protesting it. He's mad because I wouldn't give him am I okay. <laughs> he loves just eating deli meat. I'll just cut up like some ham and turkey for him and he loves it. Is that yummy? Mmm. <laughs> what are you doing? Did you learn about Groundhog Day at preschool? No. No, you liar. Hey, what, did we see the groundhog yesterday? Yeah. Because it was Groundhog Day? Yeah. And when he came out, what happened? Mm -hmm. Did he see his shadow? Yeah. Yeah, he did. So what does that mean? It sticks. Weeks of winter. There's six more weeks of winter. Oh no. Yeah, so on Tuesday when Gray went to preschool, they taught him about Groundhog Day and they sing a song about groundhogs and all that. So yesterday I showed Gray the video of the groundhog coming out, Puxatawney Phil, and he did see his shadow. So six more weeks of winter, supposedly, which looking pretty wintry right now. I mean, we're iced in I guess I can't really say we're snowed in yet apparently it's coming these are the kind of days where I kind of wish <laughs> I didn't have kids because then I could be like a snow day and I could just sit around and do whatever I want like my sister Allison is a teacher obviously all the all the schools are closed and so she just gets like a free day and they'll probably be closed tomorrow too because the snow hasn't even come yet so she gets like a super long weekend to just lay around and do whatever she wants now she is grading papers right now so like she doesn't get to do whatever she wants but i wish i had that like i don't get snow days being a parent but anyway um i feel like i've been vlogging a lot this week i've just been feeling inspired so um yeah we're just hanging out today um i'll just vlog here and there like cute things that the kids are doing um they're still loving the rotated toys so it's almost like we got brand new toys which is always fun what are you doing 
Are you going potty? Yeah. Okay. He goes to the potty by himself now, which is like a new thing. And so it's really exciting that he does that all by himself. So yeah, he is a big boy now. Okay, so it is several hours later and it's definitely more snowy. Um, you can still see grass and stuff, so it's not piled up too much, but you can see it in the dark of the tree. The snow is really coming down now. I mean, huge snowflakes. So they're still saying about, I think I saw five, five to eight, four to seven or something like that total. So um, we'll see, we'll see how much we get, but it's supposed to snow like all all the rest of today and all tonight until like 9 a.m. tomorrow or something so it's coming down I'm just trying to keep sane with the boys while we're snowed in both boys actually took a nap this is Grayson's like third day in a row of taking a nap which was awesome so that was a nice break for me we played a little bit upstairs and now we're watching a show before dinner so we've got Grayson gray no fingers we've got Porter they're watching a ABC show where they go through all the letters. Porter must really like it. Porter has gotten a lot better at watching shows. Sometimes they don't interest him, and so he and I will just play in the playroom for a little bit. But this one, he's been sitting and watching like the whole time. Gray always just sits and watches the shows. So they are occupied, and then we're gonna have some dinner, and then Hopefully Anthony will get off of work and we'll just play with the boys in the playroom until bedtime. So today wasn't too bad of a day, but it's like tomorrow's gonna be more of the same. We're still on the level two, so you're not supposed to leave the house. I I think if we get as much snow as they're saying, it might go up to a level three, but we'll see. Um, but yeah, we're just snowed in. It's really pretty to look at, but wish it was just rain, <laughs> not snow. Here's our backyard, it's just snowing. But like I said, like you can see the grass and stuff, so it's not that much yet. But it's really just been ice like all the way up until now. And now it's like snow. Um, the school's just canceled for tomorrow. That doesn't really affect us because um, Gray doesn't have school on Fridays anyway. So just another regular weekend for the rest of us. So um, yeah, we're just kind of hanging out. I'll vlog some more after dinner when we just play, but we're just trying to stay sane. I wish I could just like lay around and have a true snow day, but darn, no such, no such luck with the kids, but that's okay. They give me time when they watch videos like this. Show me how you're, how you're a turtle. <laughs> oh, can you get that band-aid and throw it in the trash, Gray? No, I'm fine. <laughs> Please. A. No. Okay. Say yes. yes Say yes, mommy. No. Mommy. I would love to throw that away. No, mommy. No, mommy. Great. Porter's finishing up dinner. Gray didn't eat dinner. He didn't like it. Rude. We have the Olympics on. This is like pre Olympics because the opening ceremony hasn't even happened yet. The USA I get the hockey. What? I get that band-aid the trash. Oh, thank you, Grayson. That was very nice. <laughs> Grayson has recently been saying no a lot to me. I think he's testing boundaries and seeing what he can get away with. And so I've been trying to teach him like you don't say no, you say no, thank you. And certain things like if mommy asks you to do it, you need to do it. So we've been working on limits and boundaries. Um, but I usually don't ever turn the TV on unless like the kids are watching a show. Um, but if it's like the Olympics or some like big event, I'll just put it on in the background in the TV. So, um, since the Olympics will be on for like two weeks, we'll just have that on whenever it's on the TV, just for background noise or whatever. Maybe the kids will get inspired by some winter activities. I don't know. Snow is still coming down. Snowflakes are huge. I need a vacuum. I need to vacuum our living room because it's seen better days. 
Does anyone else's husband ignore the coat closet where all the shoes are supposed to go and just makes his own closet right behind the couch? Because that's what my husband does. Three pairs of shoes right there. What are you doing? You're falling into the pillows? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Are you stuck? Yeah. Oh man. Always something with him. He cracks me up. Watch this. Porter gets so excited. Hey Porter, should we vacuum? No. Do you want to vacuum the living room? No. no. Yeah. 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 He gets yeah. so, he loves when I vacuum. Where's the vacuum? Yeah. Where is it? He knows where it is. He loves it. He cries when I have to put it away. He loves when I back you. Where is it? Oh, there it is. There's the vacuum. Should we get it out? Okay. There it is. Now we can vacuum. He knows we got to uncoil it. What got the vacuum. Yeah. Yep, we're gonna vacuum. Are you ready to vacuum? Yeah. Yep, we gotta plug it in. Here we go. Okay, so it is the next day. It is finally finished snowing. And we sure got a lot of snow. It's hard to tell. I took out a tape measure. Like, look at this little truck that we have it's like almost covered and it looks like we got about four and a half to five inches at least from what my thing said so it's deep and gray was begging me to go out and play so we survived the snowstorm we didn't lose power we're just snowed in our streets are not plowed and so we're stuck at the house what do you think porter Porter's like me, he doesn't care for the snow. Gray is adventurous, he loves the snow. Gray is making tracks. You're making tracks? Yeah. Good job, you're doing so good. I'm hoping this will just wear him out. <laughs> Look at that truck, it's like buried in the snow. <laughs> is that so crazy? Mm -hmm. So the thing about our house, the good thing about it is we pay really low city taxes because we're like technically in the main city. Like not, we're not in the main city, but we pay the main city taxes, which make them cheaper. But the bad part about it is um, when it comes time to plow the streets, we're always the last one to get plowed because we're on the very edge of the city. And so, like, it takes us days to get out of our neighborhood. Like, people keep posting in our Facebook neighborhood group saying that they just keep getting stuck in the snow because the snow is like sand. There's so much of it, and it doesn't compact down when you drive over it. So, not cool. Anthony spent his lunch break, and I spent nap time plowing our driveway we finally got it mostly done so that's good we can get in and out of our driveway but we cannot go past the street anthony has four-wheel drive he's got a jeep so i think he'd be okay out on the streets i have a civic which is just a two-wheel so i would get stuck so um thankfully we don't have any plans really till tuesday when greg goes to preschool so should be good by then since it's friday now but yeah it's we're gonna be home for a while we've been home since wednesday so it's just feeling like a long time what happened gray you you lost a glove okay let's fix that look we lost one of our fence posts here you see each each uh fence piece has three lines and this one right here only has two the top one fell so have to fix that huh uh oh your glove came off again I might put two gloves on you. You want two gloves? Yeah. Okay, just stay there. I'm gonna go get two gloves. Are you in the house, Papa? I got shoes on him. He's still not confident in them, so he's just crawling. You want me to close the door? Uh, hang on, I gotta dig it out. <laughs> Can't even close this door. Okay, no. 
What you doing, Gray? You picking some icicles there and eating them? Yeah. Grayson found the joy of icicles and he is eating them all. Yummy. What's up, Popport? Let me close it. Peek-a-boo! Uh.